Good morning, day fam. Welcome to a whole new vlog and a whole new house and our dreams coming and true. Mom's standing up. Yeah, and mom's standing up. I'm at the top See, of the stairs. I'm this tall. Yeah, like, and I have the UGG slippers on, and they I'm have. I'm at the bottom of the stairs. <laughs> yeah, She's this tall. is what it. Yeah. This is what it takes to get me down the stairs, but I want to show you guys like how innovative you can I'm be. I'm brushing my hair. I had a shower. When you have a broken pelvis, Ooh, yeah, all, yeah, all our um, no, that's going downstairs to the kitchen. Oh, okay, give it. To Everything me. I put on this banister is going down to the kitchen. All right, so I'm going to show you what I've done. I'm going sh to share it with you all. Don't judge though, you guys. Um, so basically, when I'm upstairs, I use my handy dandy walker to get around. Good. When I get to the top of the stairs, I line myself up with this. I bend a little because oh, don't fall. <laughs> almost fell. first time you don't ever vlog and go down the stairs. But basically, I hold on to the railing, slide my feet down, hold on to the railing, slide my feet down. Like I learned this the first day. When you have only one uh, bathroom on the on the upstairs, you learn really fast <laughs> how to do stairs. <laughs> yeah, but we'll, wait till we'll just be fit walking to the bathroom. Yeah, it sounds like this. Don't ever move to a house again where there's only one bathroom and you have to go up the stairs. He's like, we're just gonna get fit going up and up and down the stairs to the bathroom. We're gonna quickly put a bathroom in the barn. <laughs> yeah. We're gonna put a bathroom in the barn, but that's a lot longer walk. So, anyways, yeah, here I go, you guys. I'm almost there, and it definitely does hurt a little. But because of the way I fell, if I bend in half. It doesn't hurt as much. Anyway, uh, there's my chair waiting for me at the bottom of the stairs, and that's what I use to get around inside the house. I just need to move it back a bit. Success! But now I'm going to show you guys how I learned to go up the stairs. Like, it, the up the stairs doesn't even hurt me. It's amazing. You guys, look what I just found on our on our railing. Storm's horseshoes. Isn't that so cool? Oh, I put that there. Okay, so this is what I do to go up the stairs. All right, so I get close to the stairs. And then I just climb up the stairs like this on my hands and knees. <laughs> you look like a cat doing that. I look like a baby that. learning how to do stairs. In fact, most of the things that I learn to do, I do like a baby. I'm not going to go all the way up because then I have to come all the way down. But yeah, that's what I do, you guys. And I could probably and the steps are really small even go down the stairs this way as well. Uh, hair dryer got left at the old house, so we're going to make another trip back there, get more stuff. So that's what happened yesterday. Like we've got no grass anymore. So basically uh, there's a lot of holes filled in yesterday. All this is gonna get grass. But our driveway is essentially gonna go right, around like that and all the way around back up to the house. So then we'll be able to actually um, pull the horse trailer like in a big loop and it'll just be a lot easier. Can't wait to take you guys for a walk around the property and I think I could do it today but the only problem is is that uh, it's all mud out there and I'm like nervous with my walker and my but I'm, I'm dying to do it. I'm dying to get down there walk around the property. <laughs> I was trying to get out there with Stella. Here comes Gabby. Storm kept his bell boots on today. Cool. Hey, Stormy. Laura out there. Let's see if Stella's gonna come today. Where is Stella, by the way? Stella's way in the backfield. Yeah, so. Yeah, shut Oh, man. Hey, look, I have no walk. I have no wheelchair now. Maybe she'll be more receptive of me. Stella! 
Hi, honey. Like, you have Hi, look how dirty she is. Oh, yeah, she's like looking at my walker. <laughs> I love how expressive she is. Like, I can't wait to bring her home. So cute. Like, we would play yeah. with her so much. Walk her, yeah, play with her. Yeah, we can come over here like every single day. Yeah, we live close we to here. We can go home with the horse and then yeah. come back right away. Yeah. Because we live like 10 minutes from the... Park. Yeah, we live 10 minutes away now. Before we lived like 30 minutes away. Oh, okay, yeah, it's not It's not food. It's not she food, Stella. <laughs> She can't be too scared of this. All right, let's take her in. Some of you guys were saying that she wasn't scared in some of our last videos. I just didn't show that part. She was like huffing and puffing and freaking out. So just go on. So just go on and leave. So just go Did ya? Yeah. Cool. Hi Stella. You're all dirty. Uh -huh. Must have been rolling. Oh yes, she's been rolling. It's an old woman out in the field. <laughs> wow, that's got to be painful. Well, there's no way I'm pushing a wheelchair. Look at the mud. Look at the mud. I can't push the wheelchair through that mud, so you gotta walk. <laughs> Slow but steady. Storm's looking at my walker out of the side of his eye. He's like, whoa, what is that? His shoes are good? Yeah. All right, so, how, all right, how's his blanket? Good. His blanket's good? Good boy. Are you behaving in the field? No, because like, it's only like, Aww. No, it's because he wants to see a treat. I, I have a confession to make. When we got Stella, I did not think she was a pretty horse. Like, I didn't look at her and think, wow, she's so pretty. I, she looked like, I don't know, she looked like a draft horse. Draft horses are pretty too. I don't know how to explain it. But now I think she's beautiful. It is January. That means our saddle, your, your saddle should be in any time now, in the next. I was thinking the 7th of January, but it might be like the middle of January. Imagine how beautiful your plum is going to look with a brand new saddle. Are you excited to get it? No, I just need dark brown gloves, dark brown shoes, dark brown helmet, dark brown vest, but they don't make dark brown vests. So you match your saddle? Yeah. So Gabby's going to ride Stella today, just walk trot a little tiny bit. After she After rides Storm? I'm not because I'm not taking off spurs. I'm no. putting them back on. Yeah. And I'm riding my horse first. Yeah. I get all this energy yes. out, so. Yeah, so Gabby's gonna wear out Storm, and then Sophie's gonna get on him, and then she's gonna wear out Stella, right? No, I'm not getting on Stella. I feel so blessed to have her, though. Like, look at that face. I just wanna love her. I always wanna kiss her. I, she's the kind of horse that would follow you anywhere around your farm. And that's what I want. Put these on, so these for the back, and then these for the Yeah, front. try it, and then if Fiona says no. Yeah, I have to clean his legs first, oh. or else it will irritate him. Let's talk about so um, barn cats. People keep asking me as well, are we gonna get a barn cat? I can't do it. I cannot get it. I cannot do a barn cat, and I know how valuable they can be and how important, but I have a story to tell you guys. Basically, we used to live in the country before we moved to this house, and our cat, Dustpan, was an indoor-outdoor cat. She came in when she wanted, she went out when she wanted. She was a hunting hat cat. She hunted everything all the time. Like, she was super amazing. Then when we moved, and we brought her in, I saw the biggest change in her, and all the things I thought were making her happy, being indoor and outdoor, were not making her happy, and I can never do that to another cat again. Okay, this is what the tackle room looks like when everybody's here, when there's so many people here, but look at that, look, that's amazing. Thing. But yeah, that's what the tack, tack room looks like with everybody here. Look at how cute Storm looks in all his colors. Uh, we still have to order the front boots for the Lemieux support boots. But yeah.
So that's awesome. Thank you so much for that. Then they will ever be. Don't you know that you're beautiful? Let's take the back door. Charging your left leg. Don't worry, pull it on right 
give it to you. No. Oh my God. Storm did. Storm did a happy hop. And Storm fixed his lead and did a happy hop, and Sam missed it. And Gabby is like, I don't know. <laughs> She's all worked up over it though. You're walking into the door. so <laughs> good. Got lots of energy today. That's his New Year's resolution. Hey, Gabby. Gabby, that's Storm's New Year's resolution. <laughs> Be more forward. All right, guys. Ruby's here with us, and we are going to show you Ruby. Ruby. Ruby and we are going to show and Sophia and we come on are going to show you the horse's field. Yeah. Come on, Ruby. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Ruby. Ruby. Come on. Oh. Okay. <laughs> it's 
we go. I walked the whole time at the barn today. I didn't even use my wheelchair one single solitary time. It was awesome. I'm dying to get out there and walk the property. I want to show you guys like our hay fields. I want to show you more like around the barn and stuff, but they're working out there trying to get the, the because they put the new water line into the barn. We're trying to get it all done, but we had our very first paddock injury. Our very first, like we've lived here for one day and we had our very first paddock injury. Tell them what happened. I fell and scraped my knee. And look at Bye bye breeches. And my other one too, just this is not bleeding. Yeah, so we know there's a cut under there. Are you okay? Mm -hmm. You think you're gonna be okay? Mm -hmm. You think that's a sign? What? You think that's a sign? They were running ahead and Ruby had so much energy. We're literally hardly even moved in and Gub is just chilling. <laughs> guys. I'm lame guys, I'm lame. Yeah, she had her first panic injury and now she's lame. But uh, Levi is like in the new house. He's been really quiet because it's new, all new to him and we have to keep the chair away from him. If he comes on here, literally, he'll poke a hole. Like he literally, like did he do that? Yeah. Yeah, like, gotta keep the chairs away from him. Anyway, we are having leftover lasagna for stuff. So I'm gonna go. I just checked it and it's back. Yeah, she has a scratch. It's mostly, yeah, it's mostly just a, sc a scratch. Um, anyway, I'm gonna end today's video. Sam has gone back to our other house. I guess like he's just gonna, every day after work, go back to that house, pick up a load of stuff, bring it home. So we'll just be moving like the rest of our junk slowly. A lot of it's just storage and stuff. But yeah, so like we finished our first day here. Today, yesterday, it was such a rough day. I was crying and crying and crying. And then today has been seriously the best day. The littlest pain has just been, uh, it's just been fabulous. What a great way to 2019. Anyway, that is it. We will see you guys um, tomorrow. And hopefully I'm going to do like a little property tour for you guys. And show you guys around. Because I I'm, I don't think that we're going to leave. We might go to Ikea. I want to go to Ikea. Because there's some stuff I need to get. But anyway, that is it. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.